Oh my god, it's been so long. I have been trying to figure out for the past two hours how to film a video because my sister let me borrow her camera and I can't figure out how to work it and it's not picking up enough of my braces um, so I could show you guys. So, um, looks like we're on my cell phone in my bathroom because it has the best lighting in here. Um, so anyways, I wanted to let you guys know like what's been going on with me. Um, I was in the middle of a move freaking crazy I was moving from Northern California to Southern California and I'm so excited because a little backstory is basically I do medical cells and um, when I was 21 I started and I didn't think until I was 30 that I would get into oncology and I got in and so I'm 25 I'm so excited because I'm five years ahead of my goals and I just I can't be more excited and feel more blessed to have the opportunity to move back down south so excited about that because I love the beach. Um, I moved from Southern California up to Northern and so it feels nice to be basically like kind of home for me. Um, so anyways, um, the story started. So basically I went to my orthodontist and like two weeks ago and told him I was moving. He's like, well, you're moving? His name's Dr. Ellen Nikiotis. If you guys live in Northern California in the Silicon Valley, go to him. He's amazing. Um, and he's a person I feel like that could handle my case. And the thing I like about him too is he's not big on extractions for adults. So he just did an expander rather than um, pulling my teeth, which I think is really crucial. Um, and so I just really like him and he's super professional. So anyways, I went there and I was like, Dr. Ellen Akios, I'm moving. He's like, you're moving, what? You need the thickest wire and we need to start making do it, doing adjustments for your bite, and blah, blah, blah. And I was like, oh no, because I knew it was gonna kill. So anyways, I guess for your braces, usually they step you up for the first like four months up to the thickest wire. So basically I jumped from the thinnest wire to the thickest wire and I have rubber bands on too, which I'm gonna take off in just a second um, because I can barely talk. So anyways, um, I have to wear my rubber bands 19 hours a day and you probably, they said I should switch my rubber bands every four hours because they lose their elasticity. But let me just show you guys really quick because I wanna take these things off. So. There's spaces, like these gaps, in my teeth where they need to fix my bite. So, I wear my rubber bands as much as possible. I don't wear them to work, because um, I'm talking way too much. And as you guys can see, like it really changes the way I talk. So, um, I just wear them when I get home and while I'm sleeping. And obviously I don't change them while I'm sleeping, because I'm not gonna get up in the middle of the night to switch my rubber bands. <laughs> So anyways, um, they put my top and bottom brackets on. My teeth were so sore because they went to the thickest wire. But, there are my braces. And it's so weird because today I was on my, like right along with one of my teammates. And he was like, you have braces? I was like, yes, dude, I have braces. <laughs> He's like, what? I didn't even notice. Um, and not a lot of people do. So I just would encourage adults who need braces, like, go ahead and do it. I have the clear ones on. Like, no one even notices. And I was talking to this guy in the gym today, and he, like, didn't say anything. He's like, you have braces? I didn't. And he's like, I don't care. I didn't even notice. So um, I just think that you should just go ahead and do it. And my teeth are not that sore at all right now. Um, after, like, a few days, they're not sore at all. Um, and the rubber bands, I literally can feel, like, my jaw shifting with them it's the weirdest thing ever um but other than that like nothing else really is going on may 9th i go in for my final appointment with dr ellen ikiotis before i switch to dr harner in huntington beach so it's going to be a little bit of a drive for me but totally worth it i heard he's absolutely amazing if you're in the huntington beach Newport Beach, California area, and you know orthodontist or even in LA, I'm commuting for him. So I'm um, super excited. And um, oh, one more thing, they didn't put brackets on my baby teeth, so my baby teeth don't have brackets. Um, and yeah, and hopefully that's it. I'm literally a hot mess right now, you guys. I like put on some makeup for the video, but I'm in sweats because um, I'm like super lazy, so tired. I had to get up at 6 a.m. or 5:30 a.m. this morning. So anyways, um, that's it, and I'm going to go ahead and post this, and I'm so sorry again for being so late, but next week I'll be on time, I promise. Okay, bye YouTubers, I missed you guys, I missed you guys and being back on here, so um, yeah, see you guys next week.